Ah, one second, I just need to check if this is gonna work. Can you just touch that sausage? Oh, I've never seen a sausage that conductive. Hello? You want me to go around Europe building more of my crazy musical instruments? So I've got to build it out of junk found in each city all within 48 hours and then play it live. Bring it on. Can I bring Cosmo along? I'll be lonely without him. Go on then, what's the name of the show? Ooh, junk Rock TV. Let's go. Hello, I'm Look Mom No Computer and you're watching Junk Rock TV. In this series, we're going to be straggling around Europe, haggling for junk to make musical instruments out of, of course. Today, we're in lovely Berlin, the land of beer, bratwurst, banging tunes, and bears, apparently. So what we're waiting for? Let's go! I've decided to go and see my mate Heimbach, who's got loads of fun musical toys. Hopefully, I'll get some inspiration for my musical machine. Oh, hi, Sam. How you nice doing? You. Come on in. Ooh, sounds mean. Damn, that's a beefy tone. Peter patters out and Finn. So what is Berlin's connection to synthesizers? The sound of synthesizers is like the lifeblood of the city. We're right now like in the synthesizer triangle. There's patch point, one corner that does see at Lombarda and search. Then you've got common ground, they do modular synthesizers and uh, also like all these effect boxes. And then you've got Schneider's Laden, which is like the hub responsible for the modular synthesizer explosion in Europe. And of course, there's the techno scene. Thanks a lot, Heimbach. All of that jamming's got me quite hungry. I'm starving. Feeling pretty peckish back old Cosmo. Dun, dun, dab, Sam. Cosmo, how's it going, mate? What's good to eat around here? When I used to DJ at Bertrand back in the 90s, there was a great Indian place right around the corner that did a tear in the loo. Too spicy. What's a rib? Well, they also do karma for people like you. Yeah, that's not spicy enough. Well, Currywurst is a local delicacy in Berlin. Maybe give that a go. Just right, man. Thanks a lot. See you later. <laughs> Nothing like a Currywurst after a synthesizer jam. I wonder how this Currywurst is made. <laughs> I'm here with Simon, the sausage man never sleeps, and we're going to make some sausages. Are you a bit tired? Nah. You don't sound very German to me. Where are you from? I'm from New Zealand, bro. I moved here about eight years ago, here in Germany, making sausages, showing them how it's done. Slicing sausages. How good of a sausage maker do you think I'd be? You probably have to do like a three year apprenticeship first. But I want sausages now. So I hear you're a bit of a musician, Simon. Yeah, I play guitar, bro. Have you ever thought about incorporating sausages? into your music. How would you do that? I don't, I don't understand. Hmm. Ah, one second. I just need to check if this is going to work. Can you just touch that sausage? Oh, I've never seen a sausage that conductive. So this sausage is receiving the electrical pulses from your finger and transferring the strain to that sausage twisting around. You're a genius. You're an absolute genius. Thanks a lot, Simon. I think you've given me the perfect idea for my musical machine. Hey, look, Mum, no computer guy's got some issues. Check what I found. A nice Berlin flea market. Let's see if we can find some thrifty deals that I can pounce on like a puma in the night. I can smell a bargain. Umbrellas have metal things inside them. They could be used as a skewers. 
It's a good idea, but not good enough. Cheers, it is. Yes, this is the one. So instead of umbrellas, we're going to use bike wheels. These are going to be the skewers for the sausage synth. How much for these two? Thank you, thank you very much, mate. Cheers. Check this out, what is that? Oh, check out all this junk. But yeah, let's uh, try and find the rest of it. So we made it over to Kunststoffer, a center for recycled materials, and we're gonna come and pick up some stuff, maybe a bit of wood. Some pretty sweet recycled things in here. Look what I found. Oh yeah, this bit is gonna be perfect for the skewers. Nice. Can't beat a few knobs, eh? Ooh, maybe I could give it a lick of paint. And as if by magic, here's the frame for my sausage sim. Here we are at Common Ground, home of Coma Electronique. So I've got all the wood for the machine, got some wheels, we've got some metal for the front panel. We've got loads of bits of electronic gubbins and knobs to finish it all off. So here's the plan for the vast keyboard in the world. Firstly, I'll get the case screwed together and get the metal panel on the front. Looks a bit like a barbecue already, doesn't it? Then it's time to drill some holes. Add the bike spokes and the sausages, of course. The brains in this one revolves around an Arduino, which when combined with my compositive conversion circuit, turns the sausages into a fully playable 22-note keyboard. But how on earth does poking some pork actually make music? Well, the whole thing works with capacitive touch technology. It's exactly the same as your smartphone. Well, sort of. But instead of touch-sensitive screens, it's more like touch-sensitive sausages. <laughs> when you touch a chorizo, it senses the electrical charge in your body, telling the circuit board to send signals to the sound-making device. Thus creating that thick, meaty tone that we are all striving for. I present to you the Zivas keyboard in the world. The first thing we're going to do is put the case together. You beauty! I've got to find a way of bending this piece of metal to shape. I've got to put more welly into this one. Right now, I'm putting dots of where I need to drill for the skewers to hold the sausages. Time to get down to the daily grind. <laughs> These are going to be the skewers for the sausages. Ah! Let it dry. Time to make some handles. So I think we're done out here. Time to take this inside. So we've got the case made. Now it's time to add some skewers to put the sausages on. Ah, every time. I don't know why, but this machine really spoke to me. You know, like bike spokes. Get it? Bike spokes? Well, that was the first joke I have ever heard. Just it? Yes. <laughs> Cosmo funny. Now it's time to put the brains in. Okay. I think we're done, but it feels like there's just one thing missing and I can't work out what it is. Sausages, of course. Now let's have a jam. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the first keyboard in the world. <laughs> yeah.
that was the first keyboard in the world.